Hey y'all, it's me, Carla. Uh, I had to get on here real quick to tell you, uh, y'all ain't gonna believe what happened to me today. I'm sitting back there on that bench right over there, and I'm like, you know, minding my own business, drinking my soda. And the uh, lady sitting in the other bench said, she looked over and said, oh my God. I was thinking, what the hell is this bitch's problem? And then I looked to where she's looking. It looked like a finger's coming out of the ground, a giant finger. I said, what the hell? And she said, oh my God, took off running back that way. Her car was over there. She gets in her car and leaves. All of a sudden, I hear a noise, which sounds like a freaking avalanche, okay? And the ground is shaking, going like this. I'm like, what the hell's going on? And I hear this. And I look, a face is coming out of the ground. With dirt falling all over, the head's coming out. I'm like, holy shit, there's a freaking giant coming out of the ground, y'all. Would I ever think a giant's going to come out the ground? It's like this. Oh, man. Oh, man. The dirt's falling all over. I'm like, whoa. I, I got scared. I was going to run the other way, but I approached him, and I said, uh, what you do? You need help or something? Hey, man. So I start digging with my hands, you know, I'm just digging. And I go over, I see a freaking leg pop out, y'all. And I start digging with my hand. I'm like, I'll help you. I'll help you. Here it come. And all of a sudden, a freaking arm, another freaking arm comes out of the ground. I'm like, what the hell's going on? So I just keep digging. He's like, hoo, 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 hoo. Finally, our dirt falls away from his face. And I'm like, touch his leg like, I'm, I'm going to help you, sir. And when I felt that leg, okay, something got alive in me. In my, in my loin area, in my privates, I said, whoa, you feel so nice, sir. And he's like, I think he was English. He's like, ma'am, this is no time for you to uh, talk about me leg. And I'm like, whoa, you, what the heck? So I just start rubbing on his leg because I ain't never felt something so nice, you know. Stop rubbing me leg, ma'am, help me. So I start digging, you know. I go over by his hand. And I, like, put my hair in his fingers. I'm like, can't you feel that spark between us? Can't you feel that, sir? He's like, yeah, have you lost your mind? I'm like, no, sir, can you feel this connection between us? I ain't never been with the giant sexually. What do you say we, you know? And he said, you know what? Actually, what he said is, you know what? Well, if you help me, I'll do anything you like. And I said, all right. And all of a sudden I look over and on his face, he's kind of looking like this. So I come over and slowly but surely place my, uh, like my crotch area right on his lips, okay? And at that time I just hear this, oh no! And uh, he, he was frozen in time, y'all. He got stuck. And uh, I think I, I don't think I killed him, okay? I think that he is turned to stone, kind of like a Medusa type situation. So if y'all are into voodoo or something, send somebody to help to reverse this, because I feel bad. Uh, I don't know if it was the smell of my crotch or the taste, but one of them got this guy all fucked up. I never even got his damn name. So I'll be coming, it's in Chesterfield, so I guess I'll just sit over here on the bench and anybody that knows the magic spell or plays the, the game magic or has a top hat, if you could come out here and help me, that'd be great. Thanks.